Hello and welcome to Thought Provoking Deck. I'm Zach and in today's video I'm going to be talking about playing Realm Morale on Shadows Cloud Gaming Platform. Overall it was a very good experience and Realm Morale is one of those battle royale games that's free to play, very similar to Fortnite. It has its own little cool unique attributes but overall it's a very fun game and it was a very good overall experience on the Shadow platform. So guys without further delay let's go ahead and get it. Before we dive into the results, I first want to talk about the graphical quality settings and of course as normal I play at the highest quality settings to give you guys a worst case scenario of what you should be able to expect. Of course you could always turn down graphical settings to get a little bit better experience but this should give you a worst case scenario and in a game like Real Morale where it's not too graphically demanding, it's very similar to Fortnite in terms of the art style. Of course it does have some very unique differences in terms of gameplay, it has classes and abilities those are pretty cool and add a unique mix into the battle royale games that we've been playing with PUBG and Fortnite and similar games. Uh, so it is a nice refreshing look. But anyways, I digress. We're talking about the quality settings here. Uh, so anything, anyways, everything was at the highest quality settings possible, including the view distance. So let's go ahead and dive into the results here. We, on the minimum side, we I did play through two different playthroughs. Both of these were full matches and I did take the results from two longer matches uh, simply because I didn't want to take the results from a match I only lasted two or three minutes. So I played, I don't know, probably 10 matches and I took the, the longest two matches for today's video. So on the minimum side, we averaged right around 50. Uh, we had one that was 47 and one that was at 54. Uh, so with those results, you're very close to it, actually a 60 FPS experience and that's on the minimum FPS side. So of course we should expect our average to be higher than that and it was right around the 80 FPS mark, a little bit higher than that, but we should be expected on most times to get a, a average of 80 FPS, which is a very good overall experience. The only way you're gonna get a better experience than that is if you might turn down the quality settings a little bit and have a high refresh rate monitor possibly, that of course will require more bandwidth than if you're playing only at 60 FPS. So do keep that in mind and make sure your internet connection will be able to sustain that. But it was a very fluid experience. I really didn't notice any difference between playing locally and playing on the cloud, especially with a game of Realm Morale where it could be a little bit faster paced. I'm actually better at it than Fortnite. I don't know why. Um, but anyways, that's a whole other topic. But very good performance here. And now let's go ahead and dive into the next slide, which is going to show the actual FPS results for a two minute segment of gameplay from my playthroughs. So as you can see here in this second graphic, the overall experience was very consistent. In fact, for the most part, we're staying within a 80 to 95-ish frame range. Uh, there are, of course, dips, but when the game does dip, it usually stays lower for a period of time, so it's not all over the place. It's not going from like 50 FPS all the way up to 90 FPS and jumping all over the place, it's usually pretty consistent. So when it's lower, it's usually lower for a period of time, possibly when more player models are on the screen or something along those lines. So with this data here, we can definitely draw the conclusion that Realm Real is a very solid experience on Shadows Club Gaming uh, platform. Of course, your latency to the server will come into a factor, but now that Shadow has a data center on the East Coast, and the West Coast, and of course the data center in France. If you are pretty close to one of those data centers, you should have a very good overall experience. And it definitely does achieve our golden standard of 1080p at 60 FPS. In gaming in general, I think that is a very solid experience. Of course, some people strongly believe uh, that 4K or high refresh rate gaming is where it's at. But for cloud gaming, when data needs to be considered too, I think 1080p at 60 FPS is a very good mark to reach for. And I think Realm on Shadow is going to be a very good fit for that experience. So that pretty much covers the performance side of today's video. All right, so our final segment for today's video is going to be some gameplay, just to give you guys a little bit better idea of how well this experience actually plays. And to give you guys a little bit of gameplay of Realm Royale, if you actually have never played of it or even heard of it. So do enjoy the gameplay, and if you just came here for the performance results, thanks for watching guys, I do appreciate that. But I will be doing the full conclusion at the end of the video, but once again, thanks for watching and enjoy this gameplay. I'm at 85 shards, how many you have? Uh, 60. Can you drop shards, like, can, so no. we can combine them with one person? No. Yeah, okay. take those though. Because I have to get 100... Well, technically, oh, Is that you? Nope. 
their forge is done, so they're probably on the move. You see him? No. There he is. At, uh, east. I've got a lot of hits on him. Jeez, here, come next to me. Uh. Oh, shit. Do you have health potions? I think I got one in a chicken, maybe. I'm a chicken. In the, in the inside the building. Uh, they know we're oh, chicken. Dang it. They, oh, oh you inside. got it. Yeah. Damn it. I'm Shit. Gonna get back. They're coming for me quick. Can you jump out the window? You can! <laughs> you might Force like, oh, oh, no. I, no. Force I get down there. Yeah, they're down there. Yeah. Yep. Uh, yeah, it's nice and gold. I'm gonna head chest up the wazoo. The fog sets in. I'm just gonna go get him. Should we just go get him? I'm trying to flank. Let's just do it. Then we got a teammate. Ah! Dang it, dang it, dang it. All right, guys, so I hope you found this video helpful as well as enjoyable. If you did, give it a big like. I do greatly appreciate that, guys. And also, if you're not already an, an existing subscriber, please hit that subscribe button to stay tuned for more great videos from Top Revoking Deck. Until next time, guys, thanks for watching. And Zach.